if you follow me on Instagram and on like TikTok, then you know that I've been active on there, just haven't been active here. That would've been so bad. What's up everybody, what's good? <laughs> girl taya's world taya simone welcome back to my channel you guys it's been so fucking long what's good and i'm filming off of my phone right now because like my actual cell phone that i use like every day um because the phone that i used to record on is dead as hell and uh yeah i'm gonna charge that hoe but um i wanted to vlog because it's been so freaking long since i've vlogged y'all i'm gonna have y'all at an ugly ass angle hold on y'all i'm so sorry okay Yes, it's been so long since I vlogged, and I have missed y'all so, so much. I had a subby. Shout out to you, girl. What's good? What's good? I love you. I had one of my subbies um, DM me on Instagram and was like, when are you posting more videos? Like, are you still on YouTube? Are you still going to post? Are you still vlogging? And I was like, I am. i just been so focused on everything else. Last three months have been crazy. They have been crazy, y'all. And I apologize for the lack of consistency. If you got if you follow me on Instagram and on like TikTok, then you know that I've been active on there, just haven't been active here. Like I've been active on Twitch, I've been active on my gaming channel, but I haven't been active here. And I'm so sorry. I love you guys. Don't think that I don't love you, because I love you. Like you're the best. I love you. So I'm here to vlog because I miss you guys so much. And today we're gonna have a very productive day, okay? Um, cause today I'm going to be streaming on Twitch and I wanted to do like a real chill stream, like a for real chill stream. Like I want y'all to come and vibe with me. You know what I'm saying? So if you haven't followed me on Twitch, then you should go follow me on Twitch. All my links are down below, by the way. So check it out. But yeah, y'all, we are going to be playing God of War today. The stream don't know that. I know that. My boyfriend know that. But everybody else Okay, y'all. So, I actually didn't play God of War. I actually played Overwatch 2. And then we reacted to some videos and stuff like that. Some funny, like, cut videos. And me and my boyfriend played some random PC games. So, yeah. I don't know when I'm going to play um, God of War. But it's, on, it's still on the list, y'all. It's still on the list. So, if you watch my Twitch or you're on my gaming channel, it's coming. It's coming. But we didn't play that. I just wanted to let y'all know that. Okay, back to the normal programming. And I'm really afraid to play this game because, like, I'm a gamer, but I have really bad anxiety. And when it comes to playing games in front of people, I get scared. <laughs> the only person that really, like, I'm not, like, I'm comfortable around, like, playing games around is, like, you know, my friends. Like, my boyfriend and, like, my other gaming friends that I play the game with. But, like, I, it's just, I, you know, it's all a mental thing. It's all a mental thing, and I just need to get out of my head, so... Today we're gonna be playing God of War and I'm excited. I've been on Hogwarts. Hogwarts is fire. I love that game. It's fire. We're gonna get some ice water. Get some ice water. Y'all should be proud of me because if you guys know me personally, which some of you do, um, y'all know that water, water is something that I don't drink often. I've gotten into the habit of drinking way more water than I usually do. And that's a big accomplishment for me. That would've been bad. That would've been so bad. If that is like a huge accomplishment for me, y'all. Like I don't drink water. I don't drink water and it's sad and it's bad for you and you should definitely drink water. Water is good for you, but you should drink water. It's bad when you don't drink water. That's what I'm trying to say. And I have been drinking a lot of like a lot more water this past month and i'm so proud of myself like i literally have at least two or three cups in this cup two or three cups of ice water a day and i'm so proud of myself like i really wanted to get on my water kick because like i'm trying to clear up my skin i'm trying to do all these things and soda is bad for you too much juice is bad for you so i've been trying to cut out 
soda as much as I can. Now, there are times where I do have soda, but I try not to drink it as often. Like, I had a root beer a few days ago, but I didn't finish it. Like, I think the rest of it's still in the fridge, and I need to pour it out and throw it away. <laughs> so, like, yeah. I've been trying to drink way more water. And ice water is the best. I'm, it's just so good. So, yeah. But, y'all, I really missed y'all. Like, I really did. I really did. <laughs> I haven't been, I haven't been recording nothing for this channel like and I really like miss vlogging I feel like when I vlog everybody really gets to see the real me and I just I don't know <laughs> I don't know I just miss it like I've been really like channeling my inner bat bitch okay and if you guys follow me on Instagram, y'all know I've been posting. Y'all follow me on TikTok, and y'all know I've been posting. I've been getting real, like, familiar with shit and learning how to do what the girls do. <laughs> and I'm having so much fun. I really am. My followers have gone up a lot in the last two weeks, and I'm so happy. Thank you guys for following me. So, yeah. I just have so much to say and so much. I'm just so happy, y'all. I'm really just talking at this point. This bitch said she was going to go downstairs 20 minutes ago. And I'm still up here. So let me go. And I'm going to figure out how to edit this video because it's literally all over the place. All right, y'all. So I'm going to go downstairs and I'll catch you guys down there. You know, I might post a little clip of me walking or some shit. Y'all don't know. Y'all like my hair. I'm really feeling the locks. Like, I'm really in the locks like the locks is everything these little three over here i'm thinking about like doing these again but doing like a different color okay y'all i'm gonna go downstairs let me stop wasting time i'll be back <laughs> all right y'all so i'm back from downstairs i actually ran and got me some food i got me some panda express and i'm gonna eat i'm hungry i'm not even gonna lie okay period I got me some Panda Express and I got a um, Sprite mixed with lemonade. It's so good. So good. Like I told y'all earlier, I've been drinking a lot of water, like a lot of water. And today I decided that I wanted to have not a dark soda because I feel like dark soda is dark, dark soda is the worst. But I want a regular soda, so. Don't wrap it to me. So let me show you guys what I got. I got orange chicken with fried rice. And they have this um, sizzling shrimp. And y'all know I love shrimp. So it looks so good. And I can't wait to eat it. So we're about to chow down on this right here. Period. I also got me some spring rolls. Delicious. I'm about to eat. Then I'm about to stream and it's gonna be a vibe. Let's go. Okay guys, so I just wanna do a quick little plug in um, right here. I have been trying to be more consistent with posting on YouTube and streaming on Twitch and just all around content. And I purchased this book from Her Influence. This is not sponsored whatsoever. But I just want to go ahead and shout out my girl, Saria Rain. If you have not seen her YouTube channel, go check it out. This planner has literally motivated me to be more consistent, more productive, and just all around get my life together. Um, I purchased some of her eBooks and they're very, very, very helpful. I have seen some growth in my social medias ever since I purchased these. And I honestly believe that if this is a career or something that you wanna turn into a career, YouTube or social media definitely definitely check it out I will link it down below you guys I'm just so in love with this planner and I think everybody who wants to be on social media should definitely check her out so that's my quick plug-in this is not sponsored once again but Saria Rain if you're watching this girl I love you girl I love you thank you so much for this all right y'all back to normal programming Hey babies, what's good? Good morning everyone. It is March 10th. Um, I'm sorry that the camera is shaky and stuff, y'all. I'm holding it with my hand. Y'all know I don't have no car mount yet. Um, but 
what's up good morning everybody it's currently 5 29 in the morning um i am on my way to work um i know y'all can barely see me because it's still dark outside y'all it is still freaking dark but let's come on here let's say a prayer together because i really want today to go fast like i'm so tired i'm so freaking tired y'all hear it in my voice like i'm so tired but um yeah, I just want to start off the vlog and say a prayer. Father God, thank you for waking me up this morning. Thank you for allowing me to have another day on your beautiful green earth, Father God. I pray that today will be, you know, filled with positivity, not negativity. I pray that today I will smile more than I cry. I pray that the time flies by, Father God. I pray that while I'm here, nothing goes down. I pray that I will be able to leave work on time, Father God. I pray that you protect me as I drive to work and as I get off work and drive home from work, Father God. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen, amen, amen. I pray every morning, y'all. Like, on my way to work, I pray every morning. Every single morning. So, um, and I feel like it really sets my day and stuff like that. So, you know, and plus, I just like talking to God. Like, I, I pay, I pay, I'm sorry. I pray, like, a million times a day. Like, if I'm talking to myself, I'm really not talking to myself. I'm talking to God, honestly. Like, that's, that's, that's the real, honestly. So, yeah, I will talk to you guys when I get to work. I'm about 10 minutes out, 10 minutes away. My job is, like, 15 minutes away from my house, so. But I will talk to you guys when I get to work. Um. I've been thinking about a lot of stuff, y'all, by the way. I know I said I was I'll talk to y'all, but I've been thinking about a lot of stuff. Like a lot of different stuff. And I can't wait to share with you guys. So and like run my thoughts off of y'all. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys when we get to work. Bye. Periana, big bitch, period. Hey, what's up, y'all? Okay, so I just got this car mount. This came from Five Blue. I don't know why I'm screaming, but it's been a day. I just got off work. And I was supposed to get off at 1.30, y'all. It is 2.47. I'm always doing overtime. What I'm not supposed to be doing overtime. But I just got this car mount from Five Below. And it's holding up pretty sturdy. Um, it's not the sturdiest. Because I feel like one good ass bump. And it'll fall. But I'm praying <laughs> that it doesn't. So that's what it looks like. Y'all see that? Okay. So, oh, see what I say? It's already falling, y'all. Oh my gosh. I just spent money. Maybe because it wasn't secure. Okay, y'all. So maybe I did something. I don't know. But you not falling. Y'all not falling. Y'all look like y'all on there. So we finna test this out. I think I, it was like a little latch thing in the back I had to do. So. We finna see. So it is now 2.51 and I'm about to probably head to my house. Um, I have to pick up James from work at four. So we have about an hour. Well, really not even an hour because I have to pick him up at four and because it's, because it's, um finna be three we really only have like 30 minutes honestly y'all it's hot it's folk it's hot as folk outside and it was just like pouring down rain yesterday like pouring down rain and i'm not understanding why it's hot outside you know what it's texas it's texas but um, I guess we can actually go by my house. I don't know if I said that already, y'all. My brain is like all over the place. Work was crazy. Um, I have an assessment that I need to take. Honestly, I didn't forget, but I need to take this assessment. So that's what I'm about to do before I go get James. And then when I go get James, then we'll just go from there, I guess. Okay. I get scatterbrained. Anybody else get scatterbrained? like where you just be talking and just, shit just don't make sense and you just be like just breathe that's what i need to do right now i need to just hosa because i 
because my job just be having me all over the place. But what I was trying to tell y'all <laughs> was um, I decided to do a career change as, as far as like where I work now. Because where I work now, I work at Kroger. Um, I'm a bookkeeper at Kroger. The pay is pretty good, but it's not, you know, where it needs to be, you know, because obviously all the prices are going up and y'all know I'm trying to move. So yeah, the job isn't jobbing, but I like, I like the job. Don't get me wrong. I like the job, but it's just not like the money isn't enough. I need more money. So I decided to apply to be a flight attendant. And I'm excited about it. Like I was, th I w like this lady came in yesterday, and she was a flight attendant, and she like had her uniform on and everything. And I was just like, oh my gosh! Like I thought about that, but I never really thought that I could do it because I, I thought it was gonna be like hard or like stuff like that. You would think like, oh, that's that's like different level, you know? And she's like, no, it's really easy, honestly. Like it's really easy. And I was like, for real? And I was like, well, was the training hard? She's like, no wasn't and I was like oh, okay and she was like telling me that I had like the personality for it and I should definitely do it so I was like okay cool so I applied this morning and now I have to just go home and take my assessment and I have until the 13th to finish it but I'm gonna finish it today because I, I I don't like to wait last minute one thing about me I like to do stuff right then and there you know so that's what I'm about to go do now and I'm excited I'm ready to take this test I've been in customer service since I was 15 years old and it's like I know what I want for my life and I feel like I will be dumb to miss out on an opportunity like this like I feel like I would be so dumb and that would be like the worst mistake like I feel like that would be a really like a regret you know what I'm saying and I don't want to live my life in regrets and I called my ooh wait not two police officers why do i need two police officers? i thought that was three what y'all need okay anyway i'm sorry <laughs> but yeah so i feel like i feel like i would be dumb to like miss out on opportunities like this so i decided to go ahead and apply this morning and i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited to like you know test my skills you know everybody tells me that i have a good personality to be a flight attendant i'm like do you think so <laughs> okay period now i know that um you know i have to take out my nose ring but i don't give a fuck about that stuff i don't care this is just jewelry this septum i got it in november so it's been like three months so it should be healed but i'm pretty sure if i take it out it'll probably close within like a week or maybe a few days um knowing my body it'll probably heal it'll probably close the next day knowing me but you know that's fine i could really just flip it up or like i was looking up like like what are some like placeholders i guess you can call it and like they have like acrylic um retainers i guess that's what they're called for like the septums if you have a septum piercing and you like and you know like if there's like a, a piece that i can put in the middle like or like a, a piece of plastic jewelry or something that i can put in the middle um so my hole doesn't close can you let me know in the comments down below because your girl needs to know because i'm preparing for this job because i want this job so bad i'm gonna do what i gotta do to get this job period period honey because you know they be the airlines be looking for the best and um hello hi welcome yes would you like some water of course you can have anything you want baby i am good <laughs> I'm good and I'm excited. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do, y'all. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And I was like, we can vlog everything. Like I'm gonna vlog this whole process. Y'all finna be on be with me throughout this whole process. And if I get the job, y'all gonna be on a plane with me. Y'all we finna be traveling the world. Like who don't wanna travel the world? And it's like the benefits are good. Like mind you yeah they they say your first year you're gonna be like really tired and stuff like that baby i'm tired now like the shifts are 12 hour shifts oh uh, baby i'll be up 12 hours i'll be up 24 hours honestly the life of a content creator baby i can do it i can do it i i don't care watch me <laughs> watch me so yeah i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited so i'm gonna see you guys upstairs when i get in my house and yeah. Ah, uh, 
your girl gonna be a flight attendant period pool <laughs> Alright y'all, so I am upstairs now. Um, oh my computer is like twipping, not tripping, but twipping. I don't know what's going on. Well, I do know. It's like I need another one. I've had this computer for what two years now? Two? No, three. No, two. I think it's been like two years. Yeah, I've had this computer two years. Within my first year, y'all remember, if y'all have been like following me on my gaming stuff, like on my gaming channel and stuff like that, then y'all know that, um, you know, my computer was down for a, a good minute, like a good minute. But now I got it back up. Like I was able to get it back up and it was working fine. But I feel like ever since then, like my computer has just been tripping. And now, and like even now, like it's even worse. So I just, I don't know. I'm, I've already priced a computer that I want and it's $2,700. <laughs> it's $2,700 and you know, I can't afford that, but you know, bills gotta get paid first. So just y'all. It's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. But we gon' we we I'm we gonna make do. I'm trying to make do. So yeah. Just in case there's sound. <laughs> again i just took my assessment it was really freaking long i'm not gonna lie it was really long but i feel good about it um yo um now i just gotta do like some more research on like the interview process and like the things that they're looking for because i know they're looking for like the best customer service like i feel like the way the questions was going it looks like they they want someone who is you know well-rounded very uh self-aware but also very caring you know because when you think about it when you're on a plane you know people you know be scared like i've never been on a plane before i've never been on a plane before but i'm not afraid to get on a plane i've always wanted to get on a plane so like i'm really good when it comes to empathy i'm very good at that and i believe that you know treat others how you want to be treated like that is the biggest golden rule the biggest golden rule and honestly if you can do that for the, your, the rest of your life literally honey you, you said so that's how i feel that makes sense anyway i'm on my way to go get james then i was right there was a bug in here i bought batman yesterday like the rest of the episodes of the batman telltale game that i'm playing on my gaming channel so i'm going to probably go ahead and get some gameplays in because i am behind and that's only because i'm just i'm doing everything you know me and james are behind on reactions we're behind on our ant-man review we were supposed to do an ant-man review and we did not do one like it's just been it's just been a lot and it's mostly because of work like that's mostly wh where it's from you know we we work all the time i work early in the morning and then even when i get off like i'll be tired and stuff but honestly i need to step it up i need to step it up because i feel like i waste a lot of time when i feel like i know i waste a lot of time i was watching i christine's stream the other night and they were talking about like what made them want to start streaming and what made them want to start content creation and stuff like that sorry I, I that it was a mosquito or something in here and now my arm itching <laughs> i don't know but anyway and they were just talking about like what drives them to keep content creating and stuff like that and it just made me think about it just made me think about things in a different way and I'm just going to say that I am about to push myself harder than I've ever pushed myself before. And it's like, I was telling my mom yesterday how it's crazy how 
when when you think of like life decisions you know it's like i don't know how to explain it guys like oh my gosh like you know when you watch the tv as a kid and you see like the the girl going off to college and she's trying to pick a school or pick a major and she's like feeling like she's making this huge life decision and she doesn't know which way to turn that's how i feel right now and i didn't think that i would ever feel like this but i do because when it comes to like choosing a career it's like dang like i have to think about longevity i have to think about the future and the things that i want to accomplish in life and also on top of that, living, because the cost of living has gone up. Like everything is going up, but my paycheck, baby girl. And it's like, you know, so that's why I'm like, I gotta do better. I gotta do better. I gotta do better. I gotta think like an adult. I have to make more adult decisions. And it's like, it's tough. It's tough because when I was looking like doing research and stuff, I was like, dang what if like what if i have to move like what if what if i have to move after training you know and it's like i don't have the funds to move you know so it's like it's a lot like it's a lot to think about Okay. been like posting a lot and it's just because like i i y'all know i've said this so many times like i self-doubt like I, I i'm always doubting myself a lot and it's like even when i push myself i doubt myself and it's like with this i'm like no nah, i'm not gonna push my, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna i'm going to push myself i'm not going to sit here and act like i can't do it you know what i'm saying because i know i can i didn't think i could be a manager and look at me now a whole manager you know so yeah it's i feel like this will be something great and amazing for me and if i get this opportunity y'all i'm gonna shout i'm gonna scream i'm gonna be so happy like wow you know what i'm saying so i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited and of course i'm gonna bring you guys along with me on this journey you know y'all gonna come anywhere and everywhere with me you know what i'm saying and i really honestly truly apologize for the inconsistency like for real for real i really do i all like i when it comes to this channel i just be i don't know like i just be in my head like don't nobody watch me don't nobody care about me you know stuff like that but i really need to get out of that mindset because hey uh you have the personality for it do it stop being so scared just do it if they don't like it then they don't like it and that's what i have to tell myself every day so y'all i'm so sorry i'm so sorry I'm, I'm, I'm gonna stop doubting myself i'm gonna stop beating myself up i'm gonna stop telling myself that my ideas are lame because they're not my ideas are not lame okay i'm very fun i'm very loving and i i just want to enjoy life and if i get this job y'all we are fin to live okay not live we're not finna just live baby we fin to live the fuck okay period like it's over hands down baby it's over i'm about to go get my man i don't know why i said that already but i'm gonna go get my man <laughs> don't get my man off from work and i done said that four times Taya, shut up <laughs> and i'll catch you guys probably when i am back at home <sighs> yeah most likely back when i'm at home yep that's most likely what i'm gonna do okay i love you guys 
see you in like three seconds. <laughs> Bye. What's up, y'all? So I'm at work going through my paperwork and stuff and eating a salad before somebody knocks on my door. I'm so tired. I had like three or four hours of sleep, which is what I get every day. So I should be used to it. <laughs> but I'm just going through my refunds right now. So it's going to be like a time lapse because I can't really talk much. So yeah, let's get into it. Sorry, y'all. Uh, that's my mama in the background, but um, sorry. It is what's today? It is Saturday. I'm sorry, y'all. It is Saturday, um, March 11th, and hey, yelling March 11th, and I got a bump on my face. Yay. Um, I'm about to go to D'Amico's house. We're about to have a little girls' day. We was together yesterday. She came over and we was chilling or whatever. It was, you know, fun. But today I was like, I want I miss my sister again, so I'm gonna go over her house this time. And we couldn't just relax and chill. My skin looks horrible. If y'all have any products Oh my gosh. If y'all have any products that'll help my skin. Y'all got a bump right here on my ear. That's so ghetto. But if y'all got some products that'll help my skin. Please. Please let them like drop them in the description. Not the description. The comments. I'm tired y'all. I'm working off of two. No. Three and a half. Maybe four hours of sleep. And honestly. I'm just too... I'm awake now <laughs> like I'm awake I can't lay back down like I want to like I'm I'm laying here on my bed right now and it low-key feel good but I want to go eat with my sis I want to go hang out with my sis <laughs> so that's what we got to do I got some good news today from um someone which i don't want to actually you know i'm not gonna say anything about it i'm not gonna say nothing about it i'm going to keep i'm gonna keep it to myself and i'm gonna let you guys know at the right time that's what i'm gonna do i'm not gonna say anything else y'all will just know when it happens because life is just great mm. that's all i gotta say life is great and god is amazing god is good always and i pray to him every single day every single night every second of the day in jesus name praying to my amazing father okay because he is amazing and i just can't wait to share everything with you guys once everything is done and set in stone right now it's still up like things are still happening you know still going through stuff so but know some exciting stuff is coming and i'm so excited for it so yeah but anyway um i done skipped a couple days i was supposed to vlog yesterday the day before that and i think the last time i vlogged was like two days ago but that's just because i've been on go like i've been on go all week and this is literally what is like what my week looks like like i go to work and when i get off i go hang out with my boyfriend for a little bit and then i come home and I do some more work. I've been planning out reels. I've been planning out and like felt like outfit posts or like put, well putting together reels and putting together outfit posts that I want to do because this lifestyle is an investment child. So I've been trying to put outfits together for pictures that I want to put on Instagram. And then I've been um, planning out TikToks and also planning out YouTube videos. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
So yeah, I've been working. Like I know I haven't been consistent on, I, well not consistent, cause I've been pretty consistent on social media, but I know I haven't posted on social media in a few days. And that's just because I like to plan my stuff out. I like to plan my stuff out first so I can see it and I can, I can see it, I can visualize it. And then I'm like, okay, so this is how it's gonna go. You know, and that way while I'm doing it, it's a layout and I'm like, okay, this is how it's gonna go. Mm. So yeah, cause I get scatterbrained a lot. Like y'all, if you've been here on my channel for a while, you know, I get scatterbrained like crazy. Like I'm all over the place all the time. So I just like to plan stuff out, write stuff down so I can see it. That way I know what I'm doing. I keep looking over here at me. I need to be looking at y'all, I'm sorry. But yeah. So yeah, I, right now I'm waiting on my food. I just ordered some wing stop and I'm waiting on it to be done. It takes me about 25 minutes, 25, like 25 to 30 minutes to get to D'Amico's house. So I'm waiting on my food. I put it, the order in like 15 minutes ago and it said it's gonna take 28 minutes. So I'm probably gonna leave in a minute. But yeah, I just wanted to come on here and catch up with y'all. See how y'all doing. Let y'all know what's going on in Taya's life, period. In Taya's world. Plug in the fuck. Mm. But yeah, I feel cute today. I feel good. Minus my skin is looking ugly as hell. Like, I just cannot. I really want to clear up my skin. Like, that is my, one of my number one goals in life. One of them. <laughs> it's to clear up my skin. Because it's like, look at it. Ew. Like, it's bumpy, hyperpigmentation. I have large pores, discoloration, extreme dry skin. Like, I'm just, ah, somebody help me. Somebody help me. And I'm also over my hairstyle. I'm not going to lie, y'all. My These locks are cute, but this is bothering me. And I want to perfect this, perfect this hairstyle because I really like it. Like, I really like the locks on me, but I need to perfect it to where the hair that I wrap around it doesn't come off. Because, like, not all of them like that, obviously, but look at this. Like, what the fuck? No. So, I'm over it, but I really want a wig. I really want a wig. I'm thinking about, like, making one, like, just buying bundles and making a wig. I'm thinking about that or just purchasing one. I don't know. What y'all think? What y'all think? I'll be taking some deep breaths. <laughs> I'm such an asthmatic, but anyway. Um. Hey y'all, hey, Future Tay here. Literally editing this vlog right now. Uh, but I wanted to come in here and add in something because it was something that I did want to include. And the part that I had in this vlog, I deleted it because, I don't know, I just didn't explain it well. So I'm gonna explain it now. Um, so I decided to cut back on smoking as much as I do. Um, I don't do it a lot. Um, I take maybe like five, six puffs a day. Um, but that's it. Just that one time. Sometimes I might go back twice, but that's maybe like once out of the week where I might smoke twice a day. But majority of the time, I only smoke once. But I decided to cut out doing it every day and cutting it down to like twice a week. And when I run out don't be in a rush to buy some more because money is tight and there's other things that i need to be putting my money towards so you know i don't mind spending the money on it but i don't want it to be a thing where it's like i have this money it has to go towards this no it's not something important it's not something that i need it's a want it's something that I do because I like it. It makes me comfortable. It helps me relax and it helps me sleep at night because if y'all know, if y'all know me, some of y'all know me, I don't get a lot of sleep. I don't sleep at all. The most sleep that I get a day is like two to three hours of sleep. So, but I, I don't want that to be like something that I'm dependent on. So I decided to cut out on it. We'll cut down my amount of usage on it. So wanted to add that in there and let y'all know that about me because y'all know I tell y'all everything. Not everything, but I tell y'all everything, okay? So I just felt like that was important for me to add in there and I'm, you know, really proud of myself for making this decision for myself and for my overall health because y'all know I got asthma and that's the situation on its own. So yeah, 
just wanted to add that in there so let's get back to the the vlog okay because i'm still editing and my airpod is literally falling out of my ear okay yeah it's time to go i'm happy that i made this decision because it is something that i really need to do and i feel like well i know that it will be good for me and i will benefit from it so yeah but yeah we about to go and chill at D'Amico house and i said we because y'all coming with me we finna go chill at D'Amico house we're gonna have some drinks though <laughs> I said I was I said I was taking a break from smoking. I say I was gonna stop drinking the fuck bitch. Who you thought I was? Mm, no. So yeah, I'll catch you guys when I'm at Demico House or when we are on our way to get our food. So yeah. Bye y'all. Let's go. Hey y'all, I'm back again because I did not film an outro for this vlog. I went to D'Amico's house and we ended up just chilling, having girls talk, watching some uh, movies and that was pretty much it the rest of the week um because i think this day ended on a saturday sunday was my last day of work and i did not vlog sunday i literally just took james home and came back home and went to sleep i slept the entire day literally did not wake up until like 1 30 a.m so this is basically the end of the vlog, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Next week's vlog will be up next Sunday. I'm aiming for next Sunday like I usually do. And if it's not Sunday, the alternate day is Monday. So I apologize for this vlog coming out so late. It was supposed to be out yesterday or Sunday. And it's now Tuesday. But hey, I'm trying my best to stay consistent for you guys, you know, with the circumstances that I am under. I'm being more consistent and I'm trying to you know, stick to a schedule. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. We're on the road to 1K. Make sure you guys also follow me on my Instagram, my Twitch, my TikTok, okay, period, and my gaming channel. All of my links are linked below. So make sure you guys check that out. Share my channel in these videos with your family, your friends, whomever you would like to see it. And I will catch you guys in my next vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all my new subbies. Don't worry, babies. I see you. And we'll see you next week. Bye.